cast. It's a special Tuesday combat cast. It is. It's the Tremor edition. Tremor edition. We would have loved to have been here yesterday, but we were traveling back from Evolution 2015. That's also known as Evo. Yes. Mm -hmm. We'll be talking a little bit about that before we get to Tremor, just to kind of give our thoughts on a great experience as it is every single year. It, it was amazing. Uh, all the games were awesome to, mm -hmm. to watch. The top eight was hype! Every game was hype. It was every, amazing. every game. Oh. Uh, but before we get there, we would actually want to uh, maybe bring in a special guest who can help help us with that, right? With with Tremor? With everything. everything. Talking about Evo as well. Yeah, absolutely. So, Derek, if you have the button. The button is ready. All right. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we've had him on before. We're having him on again. Mr. Steve Brownback, OSU 16 bit. How's it going, everybody? Steve's going to be here to help us walk through Tremor a little bit. He knows a lot about how the variations work and such. Now, we wanted to have PPJ on today, uh, but he's been he's sick today, so he won't yes. be joining us. Poor little guy. Um, but you will be showing us your high level Tremor play, which is, what would you say out of 10? It's a. 11. <laughs> <laughs> I've seen it. And then mine's got to be at least a, a nine. I'll argue that number. <laughs> That's awesome. Um, so let's before we get into Tremor, I know, I know you all want to see Tremor, and a lot of you are already playing Tremor right now, which is awesome. So yep. if you have, thanks for joining us. And He's available on Xbox and PS4. So Tremor it away. But let's talk a little bit about Evo. It was great. Um, it was a perfect top eight. You had the guys you expect, DJT, Sonic Fox, Honeybee, then you had the guys that you had no idea. Mm -hmm. Milky Situation playing Reptile. That was awesome. Ketchup playing Quan Chi. Yep. Not Sorcerer. He used... Uh, he did use Sorcerer. Yeah, he, he used Sorcerer. No, he didn't. Spells. Oh, sorry. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. Yes. Hold that. All right, yes. The spell one. Steve, um, Steve told me before the thing, he's like, yeah, I'd love to be on, but I am super tired. Yeah. So. Yes. Uh, Evo drains you. Yes, and uh, Zyfox playing Liu Kang. Yep. And the top 16 had a bunch of uh, the ESL players did really well. Um, a ton of people did really well. Was and, this, and this is what you were saying earlier is the first time that there was European players in the top eight. Right. Which is awesome. So in, congratulations, in our, everybody. Yes, in our game, there has never been an international player. And we had a Canadian and two UK players in the top eight. And then they invaded the top 32, which is super, super interesting. It was good. To, it was really cool to me to see that all of the guys who came over for ESL mm -hmm. did so amazingly in the tournament. Yeah, absolutely. And like I go, and just because I've been working a lot with the ESL league and whatnot, I've got to get to know Ketchup and Mustard really well, and I've you know watched a lot of their videos and watched, and they're some of the best commentators out there. Absolutely, the and, nicest guys. Oh too. yeah, and Mustard did very well. And yeah, then, I think he was right outside the top 32. He actually almost beat Sonic Fox in pools. Yeah, and yeah. then Ketchup. Get top eight. Yeah. So congratulations, truly to everyone. Let's just ask a couple questions real quick. Uh, your kind of not even surprises. What? Who are some of the players that you are excited to see how well they did? Maybe people wouldn't expect. We kind of went through some of that in top eight, but go a little further. Um, I think the biggest surprise of the tournament to me is Zy Fox placing seventh with Liu Kang. Yeah. He's a guy that when the game first came out, he was really struggling, mm -hmm. and he was not doing as well as he wanted. He was not doing as well as he did in Injustice. Right. And uh, he buckled down. He started working really, really hard. He picked a different character that he thought more suited his play style. Sure. And well, he, he played Flash, so that, it makes a little sense. Right. right. He was playing Takeda, who's more of like a long range, like, mm -hmm. you know, slower paced character. So he's like, this isn't suiting me. I'm going to go to Liu Kang, who is, you're right, in your face, super fast. He's worked, I've heard that he's worked extremely hard, and it paid off. Mm -hmm. And, and speaking I think of working super hard, Sonic Fox. Yeah, Sonic, Sonic Fox, it's expected. But I love it. He he's the best. Yeah, and that's all there is to it. It was me. For me, I have a couple things that I really enjoyed. Um, there was a lot of Kanos I was really happy to see. Um, I always talk about him with Coach Steve. You know, he did very well against Denzel. He did. He, I mean, he had a tough road the yeah. whole time. Uh, did get, did great work using Commando Kano a few times, which I was very happy to see and saw some stuff that I had never even thought of, which is no surprise to anybody. And really, there's a couple like matches like that I was so excited to see. Uh, Snake. Out of yes. Southern California, SoCal? Nor Nor NorCal. NorCal, yes. Snake fought against Nebeck, who is an amazing Raiden oh, yeah. player. We were commentating right. this match, and Snake had some of the best comebacks. Like, big props to him. I mean, you know, didn't make top eight, but he's one of those guys that obviously worked super hard and did well. Evo's the kind of stage where just because you didn't top eight doesn't mean you couldn't put on the show. Mm, right. uh, Dizzy versus Tom Brady was awesome. Oh, man. Yeah, Tom, Tom knocked out Dizzy, right? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Way to go, Tom. <laughs> so there are, there are just a ton of great matches. A big D placed ninth, but he took out Rio. 
He took out uh, Forever King. Yep. Like, he had a great showing. Just a wound cowboy. Uh, Detroit Ballin returned. We yep. hadn't seen him since the game first came out. Sure. He got top 16. Uh, just a ton of great matches. I love it because, like, I'll go to get a drink or something, and then I'll come back, and everyone will be like, did you hear what happened? Like, be like, this, 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 this. Like, within 10 minutes, yeah. some of the best players in the country are gone. Yeah, there, there was a 30-minute window where Perfect Legend and Rio... Two guys who could conceivably win Evolution were set to losers in huge upsets. Right. And that set the tone of the day where you're like, anything can happen here. Mm. No one is safe. And uh, MKX had the most entries that we've ever had for an NRS game. It Close was 1,200. Yeah, it basically doubled the previous biggest Mortal Kombat tournament of all time. And 180,000 viewers. So that was a pretty exciting time yeah. for us. So thank you everybody for watching EVO. Um, and that's the thing, it can be you too. One like, of my favorite EVO moments was the Max panel. That was a lot of fun to go yeah, and see. Um, and they're working on something pretty cool and special for Predator. I mean, we'll, we'll get there sometime yeah. soon. It'll be out in the next few weeks. Um, just generally, like, it's, for me, it's always great to go to these things to meet all the, like, there's a ton of players I hadn't met yet that I got to, like all the, uh, the guys from Combat Houston and such who I'd never uh, met before. Rattlehead, who I, who I, tweet to all the time. I interviewed him when I first got the job. Finally got to meet him and such. So it was a really great experience. I think all of us, just for a community to see like, as much as people might butt heads on TYM, when you're in the same room, everybody's having fun. Everybody's friends. It's great. And yeah, everybody was really, really nice to one another. Yeah. Helped each other out. There was times where we had issues and, you know, everybody would run around and help. Yep. It was great. Yeah, Evo's basically our big annual family gathering. Yeah. yeah. It's a little really dysfunctional nice. at times. But it happens. <laughs> So, that was EVO. We got some more big tournaments coming up in the next couple months. And, of course, you know, Blue Steel has done a lot for the tournament scene. And we're not going to say it's done doing that. So, we'll have some more stuff to announce here in the next couple of months. So, keep competing. We also, another thing we got to mention before we get to tr tr uh, Tremor, which is huge, ESL is having a Season 2. Season 2! And if, you'll, if you watched EVO, everyone who participated in Season 1 did pretty darn well at, C at, at, at EVO. Right. So this is a place where top players go, um, and there's good money there, and there's ways to show off your skill and get on streams and, you know, maybe make a little money for this for the love and the passion you have for a game. Yeah, I heard a lot of people that are like, man, I'm so thankful you guys are having ESL 2. I'm picking up an Xbox. Yeah. I can't wait. Like, it, I can't great. wait either. It was great this yeah. year. It, e ESL was kind of a preview for EVO. Mm -hmm. All those guys did well, and obviously the champion... Sonic Fox. Yeah. Sonic Fox. Congratulations. So, Sonic Fox, there's a target on your back and has been for quite some time. <laughs> Congratulations on Evo. Who's next, right? Who's next? Eh? Eh? I liked it. I yes. liked it. We use that for a... Okay, okay. let's move on to Trimmer. Uh, here's a couple, <laughs> one more introduction. Now, this oh. is very important. Jen, our usual person at the command center... Sidekick. ...is on a bit of a vacation with her friends, doing some hiking and whatnot. So we have a special guest here. Mr. John Anderson. John, say hi. Hello. Not, not too much. Just kind of keep it cool, yeah. John. Hello. Uh, John's, I didn't put your Twitter in. What is your Twitter? Standardson. Standardson. S-E-N or S-O-N? S-E-N. S-E-N. So John has been, pardon me, has been practicing quite a bit. <laughs> so John believes he is ready to do this to not make any mistakes like Jen never does. Jen never makes mistakes. And also, here's a secret surprise that no one knows until today. Jen was at Evo watching the finals. She sure was. And what? no one knew it. So, John, your first order of business is play the Trimmer trailer. Your death will satisfy my rage. Enough talk. Enough talk indeed.
I say we get right into it, huh? Yeah, absolutely. So, so we're gonna walk through some of the variations right now, yeah? Yeah. All right, so John, are we on the game screen? You got this, John? There it is. Excellent. All right. So let's, uh, let's go through. Steve, take it away. You can use it when says take it away, the other person will start. All right, so <laughs> the first one we'll start with is Aftershock, but first we'll go through his standard moves that he has in all variations. His common, shared. His shared moves. His, his normal attacks are, he, you know, he's a monster made of rock, but he's also a ninja. Who said he was a monster? You know, that's a good point. He's a man made of rock. Thank right. you very so, much. But he still has some ninja type moves. He's got like jump kicks. He's got a really fast pop up combo. But then he also has some rock normal attacks. This is his down four. Oh. Where. Now, real quick, I know a lot of people who are watching do know what that means. But like, when you say down four, all the buttons are labeled. Sorry. Three, four. Right kick. Yep. That was my nerd speak. <laughs> um, his overhead attack is his big rock. Bop, bops on the head of the rock. And then uh, his common special moves, he has a rock toss, which is a pretty decent projectile that hits in an arc. And then he has a low version, rolls across the ground. Ooh, gotcha. Which people on Twitter are already calling the cookie. The cookie? Yeah. Okay. I've never eaten a cookie made of rock, but all right. <laughs> now, one thing we'll also to mention, we always talk about this, too, is that, like, each variation has a kind of a uni unique thing about them that makes you see which one they are. So, for yes. instance, the, the Aftershock version, he is not wearing his mask. He is not wearing his mask. And um, sim similar to Kenshi, in his variations, even his common moves are usually visually or maybe they have different properties. It's a lot like Kenshi, where... You know, they look different, or they slightly do have a little bit different properties, just to separate them across the board. He also has this, which is a ground pound. It's unblockable. It's pretty fast. And the EX-1 hit them on the ground. So if you knock them down and you think they're just going to sit there, you can do that. Gotcha. And that'll hit them on the ground. Not many moves in the game have that property, so it's right. pretty special. Um, he also has this rock from the sky, which you can use to follow it up and combo them. And that one has three different distances, too. Yes. Yep. You can do the typical... So it does an auto trick. Right. So those are his common moves. And then um, after not, shot... Not all of them. Is it not? No, he's got the, the fist, man. Oh, yes, I forgot about his two fists. Sorry, sorry. So he has this straight punch, but you can also change directions. You can hold down, and it becomes an overhead that pops him up. Or you can hold up, and it becomes a pop-up. And you can loop to do combos. Cool. Or the EX version, you can charge it, and it'll have armor, or you can cancel out of it. Mm. Then he also has this rock attack, which you can hold and then release it. You can hold that? Hold that. Hold that. You can do down to do a low one, or up to do an anti-air one. And the EX-1 has armor. Cool. All right, so Aftershock is all about ground pounds. He gets this delayed ground pound. He can activate it, and then it's counting down, counting down, and then it goes off, and it's a low attack. And he can move around freely. So you can activate it, and then go for a jump in. You can activate it and get your projectiles out. And they're going to know when the countdown's going, so they have to either try to block it and get ready to block it, or they can try to hit you, because the downside is if he gets hit, it deactivates. It deactivates. So he can use that to kind of control the pace of the match, get them occupied while he plays his game. Then he also has the air one, which is also a low, and he can do that at any point in his jump, and he can change the direction. He can, do, he can be close, or far, or mid, and that could be good. Let's say you throw your ground projectile, you can jump over it, and you sure can. <laughs> from a far distance hit you, and the EX-1 pops up for a top row. Gotcha. Or he can do it offensively, like block a jump in. You can do it straight off a jump in, so you have to block low immediately, and then you can go for your throw. And you can do the EX as well on yes. high lock. Just, wow. Bang. And then you're gonna pop up. Awesome. Now, now, so you know, we always talk about when it comes to the different variations. What do you find to be aftershock sort of strengths as a fighter? I think aftershock will be for creative players who want to use kind of like setups to get their offense going. Like, you know, you could put it out and then rush in, and do a mix up. Gotcha. Or you can use it, let's say you're finding someone who's doing a really job, good job keeping you out. Maybe like a really good, a character with a really good fireball. You can put the ground pound out there and they're going to have to stop doing their fireball because the waiting time is going to happen. Gotcha. Or maybe you have an opponent who you really wanted to get him 
to start jumping, and they're really beating you on the ground. You're having a hard time approaching them. That'll force them to jump or to do something to avoid it. So I think it'll be really good for kind of setting up your game if you're in a matchup where Tremor struggles to get his game going. Okay. Uh, so that is that sort of his his game there with yeah. Aftershock version? So more of a setup-based character. Yeah. You want to move right on to Metallic? Uh, yeah, I mean, we, I could probably walk... All right. All right. No, all right. Well, that's all right. You got it. We'll both do it. So Metallic's really interesting because he has two different forms. Your standard, your gold skin, and his moves get a gold property to them. Like, you can see all the moves look a little bit different mm -hmm. and act a little bit different. Probably the biggest change is the rock punch becomes a projectile. He has a straight one, he has this ground one that bounces, and an air one that bounces and oh. it goes down. Tricky. And you can EX it, it's a little bit slower. So this, this is kind of the type of projectile that doesn't keep people out, you use it to get in. Mm -hmm. You can put the projectile out, and then kind of run behind it. Gotcha. Now, then you see Derek in the lava skin. That is a move you use to switch. Then when you're in lava, there you go. All of his moves have this lava property. They burn you up. You can see you have a little fire effect, and they have different properties. Like this move, instead of being the projectile, you can see it kind of stuns them. Or the straight one stun them. And uh, you can actually make the, the opponent stand right. from, uh, from a here. So when you finish a combo... If I can do that, right? <laughs> I believe in you. Ah! I'll see if I can get it. This time you'll get it. No, nope, oh my that, god. You do it, you do it. And this is a, this is a property that you can turn on. Oh. Yes, right. You switch between gold and lava. And you, you stay there. This quick stand, so they don't have an opportunity to do a wake-up attack or a roll away or to lay on the ground. You can just hit them and then run right in for another mix-up. Gotcha. And one of my favorite things, too, about Trevor is actually his backdash. It is. It's, it's pretty awesome. awesome. Yeah. We've actually seen it in some trailers. It will go under things. Yes. You can actually use it to avoid, like, high projectiles and stuff. But there's, like, there's quite a timing to it, but it does work. Yeah. So this is definitely a thing, like, when you turn on lava, you're lava if you turn on gold. Yes. Yeah. There, there's no time no period. There's no, like, downside. It's just purely what style you like and how it suits the match. So. In my opinion, I think the idea would be if you want to kind of zone the opponent out, you can go and do gold. You can shoot your fireballs, kind of keep them out, or use them to get in. But then, once you're in, you know, you have the better combos, the quick rest the restand. You have this combo, so normally it doesn't. Right. Okay, so, so with this version, you're actually, you kind of cover two different types of the fighting. Yeah, it's like two different play styles in one character that you switch between. Right. I'm just trying to stick the combo. Yeah. I think you can do it. Oh, no. All right. I'm done. Moving on. Moving on. All right. Moving let's, on. Take a look at, let's take a look at this other, like his throw real quick, too. We've seen some of that. Bam, bam, bam. doesn't even touch them. That's the it's power. Just... And then... Ouch. That's a little more of a, a brutal one right there. That's, That's a pretty good one. Pretty good. Man. Uh... So let's we want to show the last version, right? Crystally, but let's do it. We're doing a regular match. Yeah, let's uh, let's do it in a regular match. And uh, let's do it against. Uh, I, I've heard he has some fun talks with Johnny Cage. Is that correct? Sure. Yeah. yeah. I think everyone just saying has that because yeah. you're a Johnny Cage fan. No. I think everyone has good quotes <laughs> with Johnny Cage. Yeah. yeah. It's <laughs> tough not to have good quotes with Johnny Cage. So Crystalline is uh, maybe Cage. the most unique of the yeah, three. We keep getting the Emperor's Courtyard, which is kind of funny because rocks fall down during it and stuff, too. So That's it's very true. tremorish. Hmm. I enjoy your movies. Yay. I will enjoy this more. Round one. <laughs> All right. So, first, he gains this crystal skin. You can activate it. And then he'll absorb a hit. You see, he doesn't go into the the stuff. Yeah. yeah. So that will enable him to basically, you know, you can do it from a distance and then kind of run in, take a hit, and then combo them. And in the air, instead of getting comboed, what do we do? Like a jab. Oh, just jab you out of there. Yeah. Oh, oh, you lost it. Do it again. He'll just kind of float oh. down instead of getting combo. It only lasts for one hit. But it's a powerful tool. Like you could also use it if you're getting zoned out. Like do your fireball, and you can just 
take it gotcha. and then run it. Does it time out? It will eventually, but it lasts a decent amount of time. Okay, and it's probably also really good for wake ups, right? Like if you know your opponent's gonna wake up, you're like, that's a that's a great tactic. Yeah. Stand right over you. Go ahead and do your wake up. Right? Yeah, it's kind of weird because you can actually you can not you can use it, and then if I get hit, I'm safe. Or you right. can do what you just said and actually try to get hit. Right. You can activate it, and ba you're basically there. And then what are you gonna hit? Right. And then you can go ahead and combo them. And then the second thing he gains is the ability to summon. Interact. He actually summons it. <laughs> I've been waiting for this to happen for so long. It's so good. It's so creative. And from there, he can actually use it to jump off or throw it. So it has the same properties as an normal actable. It's got the invincibility. You know, he can use it to traverse, or he can use it as a projectile. And what's really cool is when he summons it, you can use it too. Yep. What? Oh, so there's some risk reward there. Yeah. And it does a lot of damage. It's very, very powerful. Um, and then he also, the, the crystals too, also have different properties, right? Yes. Crystals. The little power punch kind of deal here, it can actually beat projectiles. So it's kind of the similar moves the other two, but like I said, it's a little bit different in each variation. Oh, do do the, the pop up thing. Oh, yes. Yeah, so the EX low one popped them up. Oh, wow, well, yeah. What? That, that's totally a, 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 right, a right amount of meter to use for something. Yeah, that was definitely optimal. Awesome. So when someone's trying to zone you out, like if you read it right, you can just you can knock it right off. Yeah. Yeah, you gotta, you gotta definitely have a read on it though. Yeah. But I mean, you could sit back and just hold it until the right second. Yes, and then you can let it go. It will not absorb the projectile when it's like that, but yeah, you can let it go. Right. Gotcha. So okay. you, can, you can just wait for him. And of course, you could use both at the same time. So you can have the armor out while the interactable's out. Oh, oh, Tyler's trying to some stuff up. Oh, okay. see a fatality, see. No, 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 no. So good. Oh, this is a live ball. So we good. I love how dramatic that one is where he's like, nah. Nah, his arms out. Well, wouldn't awesome. you be doing that? Probably. Yeah. I'd, I'd actually probably just push the walls down. Maybe. Yeah, you would. With, with, with my strength. Guys. Oh my gosh. With these guns? For real. Woo! Put them away. You want to do one more and see if we can get a, a brutality out? All right. All right. Maybe one people haven't you seen like this. I blessed to fight Johnny Cage. Congratulations on winning the lottery. Round one. Seems like our fans pretty much find brutality pretty quick though. Yeah, that, that is true. Uh oh. But you're gonna have to fight against Tyler <laughs> going ham. Oh, let's see. Man. Don't need to let me win. Ooh. Oh. I just killed anyone. Oh. 
There it is. Oh. <laughs> that was awesome. That was rad. No one says that. Oh. No one said that since the 80s. <laughs> yeah. I think it was rad. John was a rad? Yes. Thank you. <laughs> Here, you play. All right. With Johnny Cage, or do we have to pick somebody else? You can pick somebody else. I've seen your Johnny Cage. Yes. Yeah, not, nothing to be impressed with. Not so what. It's about as bad as yeah. your trimmer. Wow. wow. I'll play my trimmer. Tyler, I like your Johnny Cage. Thank you. All right. Who are you uh, going with? I'm going to use Aftershock. Okay. All right. I'll go Scorpion for fun. Because it's so much fun. <laughs> And also, new with, with Tremors, we got some classic fatalities too, right? That's true. And I guess we'll, Steve and I, we'll, we'll have a Katana Molina match and see who can get their classic fatality off first. And it's going to be Steve. Don't say that. Um, have some faith in yourself. Yeah, have It's going to be yourself. me. Just... Tremor. You dare attack me, Scorpion. My flames can burn even you. Round. All right, I really like his rocky beard. I have to address something quickly because I just saw some tweets. Uh -huh. People are confused if they're wearing a Cubs hat because I'm such a diehard Royals fan. Oh. Who are 20 games over 500. I lost my Royals hat while I was traveling, and this Cub hat fits real well, and the Cubs are my second favorite team. That is why. I will be getting out of the Royals hat very soon. Don't worry. Um, I'm glad that, okay, that we have. Probably a lot of people tweeting that. Yeah, like, is that like one, one guy who's like, hey, what's up with that? Well, so far it's one guy, but I'm sure a lot of people are asking, right? Yeah. <laughs> Absolutely. Ooh, nice backdash. Ah, oh, I had a lot, lot to do there. Yeah. There's no point in that. Round two, fight. Which one do you uh, do you prefer right now, Steve? Well, for your game style, obviously. I think for my style, probably Aftershock, but I can't wait to see the community Tremor players figure out Crystalline. Seriously, if you find some good stuff from good uh, combos and whatnot that you really like, go ahead, like all of our you know systems can now record things. So please like tweet them to at Netherrealm, and if we see some good combos, we'll try to retweet those so they so the community can see what else is happening. Yeah, it's always fun when a new character comes out. What the community comes up with. I already saw some stuff this morning. They're like 40% one bar. Like already finding things. Like the community is so quick with it. And I cannot wait for the first time in tournament someone summons that interactable and the opponent kills them with it. Oh, that would be awesome. Do you awesome. know that's going to happen? That would be so good. Just like Kodo Khan killing himself. Yes. It's... Which I have seen in tournament. Who did it? Phil Pops. Oh. <laughs> on accident. Oh. Well, he didn't do it on purpose, really? No. <laughs> You better have a good mentality. Ooh, but Scorpion's coming back. Ah. Ah. Alright, I think I'm gonna just come back. Uh, yeah, I think you got it. Oh. Oh, so good. My body parts. It's so good. Oh, man. That had... That, I love that brutality because it kind of harkens back to like older games with the shake. Yeah. But it's still next to it. Like, that's so good. That is so cool. Should we do one more? Uh, we can do a couple more. I'll, let me play once. Okay, absolutely. You have to determine though. All right. Steve's our, our, our toy right now. Oh, let's play with Steve some more. Yay! Who are you going to use? Uh, who should I use? use? You know what I'm going to do? I'm gonna do random select. Really? Ran oh, blind boy. random select. <sighs> is that cool? Hey, that can you check the buttons too while you're there? Uh, yeah, sure. What well, they didn't feel right for you? Oh, they seem fine. Are fine. you that confident, or is this an option select? <laughs> what do you? Think? Yeah, take a release. Oh, there we go. Thanks. Uh, this it's probably a really, it's probably an option select. Okay. Really. Uh, so hidden cursor random select. All right. Roll the dice. And you're playing as... I'm going to be Metallic now. Metallic, okay. One of each. I like that about yeah. you. Very, very kind. One of your favorite bands, Metallica. That's actually true. They are. So that's cool. Wow. So Metallica, if you're watching... They are not, probably not <laughs> watching. Well, it's 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 they like, like though, because they like to rock. They oh, okay. Intro, please. Yay, puns. Oh. You will die, Kotal Khan. You are quite self-assured. How else could I be? 
Round one. How do you feel about getting Kobo Khan? I'm not very good with that. Blood God, too. <laughs> I'm so bad with Well, you know what, Evo Madsen oh, yeah, did saw. really well with Blood God Kotal. Another example of a variation that's, you know, this, yeah. probably much better than we knew as time goes on. And that's the thing, is that the game's now been out for going on three months, and there's still stuff people are beginning to, to figure out with the game, right? Yeah, I even heard that uh, Foxy and Perfect Legend have come up with some stuff with Hat Trick Kung Lao, and yep. who knows what else is going on. I knew that was going to happen eventually. Yep. Johnny hey, Master of like Storms, I'm right really excited for that, too. See if people start doing that. John plays Kung Khan. I think he's embarrassed for me. You want to end, John? You want to play one after this with, with Steve? No. You sure? <laughs> now you see, I'm using that up thing to get a little more meter. Yes. Yeah, that's why you're doing that. Absolutely. It's not because I'm dropping combos. I don't even know combo, that's why. Hey, oh, all right. YOLO. This YOLO is, is going to be like a 12 hit combo. Yeah, um, it's a lot of damage. That's good. You sure you want to play it? Maybe some shit shit or something? I'll do some shit off. Okay. We'll get you in here. Because that sucks. My dad? Yeah. Yeah, you're dead. Finish him. Oh! There we go, dead. Alright, here, hold on. It's like, it's not like he's dead enough, like. Right. Let me go ahead and smash your head, too. Just to make sure. Don't mess this up, John. John Anderson, ladies and gentlemen. Alright. There you go, my man. We've never played. We have not. Who's your main character? Shinnok. That's a that's a good choice. I thought yeah. it was Kotal. It was Kotal for a very long time. I actually. So you follow Tyler's lead, where you have a main mm. and then you change to another main. I actually had a bunch of characters I was studying and playing, and I kept jumping around like a crazy like person, a, like a lands down. Yeah. yeah. Like yeah. Tyler, do you also promise that you've loved the character and will never play anyone else? Because that's his yeah. pattern. Yeah, yeah, I do. Yeah, he yeah. loves to do yeah. that. Yeah. Pray Shinnok. Pray All right, Steve, let's do this. <laughs> Which variation of Shinnok do you like? I liked Imposter. After watching one of the ESL tournaments, I saw the value of teleporting and things like that with Shinnok. But I've bandwagoned, you could say. Oh! <laughs> so I started with Bone Shaper. I really enjoyed it. I love that it was called Bone Shaper. I think that's really exciting. It's such a great name. It's such that's a great name. That's really what I wanted. Um, that's all I really cared about. Right. Um, but I've gone back to Bone Shaper after hearing some recommendations from some people that it might be... Worth checking out. It's and very good, but. Tremor. You will not have my soul. Your soul is not worth harvesting. Round but what? So what? what? Necromancer is pretty good too now. Oh. I'm scared. It's alright. Oh. Do you like playing with the ground and stuff? Oh, I can play with the ground too, you know, like, oh, check it out, ooh. Um, I, I, well, no, you, you okay. probably shouldn't do that. Bro. Okay. You give the guy an inch, he takes it. I'll do that.
That'll never happen again. I apologize to everybody watching the show. You know what? I think John did a really good job, actually. He did pretty good. Yeah? Tremor wins. Uh, is it you when you have another one? Or you want to... Let's do another one more Tremor. Okay. One more Tremor. All right, here we go. I think the cool thing about Tremor is he's kind of hard to describe in a single archetype. A lot of characters... Oh, this character's good at zoning. This character's good at rush down. I think you can see that his tool set is Ooh, very, very why don't interesting. You, why, don't you, why don't you play and be Kano? I bet they've got something interesting Rip. to say to one another. Oh, they, they, they are fellow the black, black dragons. dragons. Right. That's right. May I use Revolution? Oh, well, that is your favorite. When you said you would never switch to a different character. I never said that. Yeah. Find it. You said you would always wear this costume. Yes. I'm you, pretty sure Johnny Cage doesn't wear that costume. You told me as soon as that costume was out, you would only play Kano. Because of that costume. Yeah. I'm trying to expand my horizons, guys. Sorry you're so close minded. Our last mission was suicide. Wasn't that fun? My current one is murder. Round one. That was after you said you'd only play Ermac. <laughs> and after you said you'd only play Jax. I also said that Jason was also good to hear. Jason, and also before the game came out when we found out about... Uh, Ferritor. 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 Oh, I'm not done, guys. I'm not even close to done. I also said it about uh, that I was going to play Zoro. And you're yeah. going to learn Sonya. Oh, right. I did start that. Yeah. And at one point you asked if you should pick up Katana. I did. I just like a lot of the characters. I have fun with this game. Sorry you guys are so cynical about my love. <laughs> well, you, you sure do spread it around. I do. Oh! It's not going too well, is it? But well, you haven't played him for a while, so I mean... Right. You're a little bit rusty. I'm very rusty with the Kano. I'm letting all my, my Kano friends down. Kano friends forever. Come here, here. They ain't over yet. Right. Yeah. Oh, yeah, nice oh. parry. Good read. Good parry. Tyler. Okay. Oh. okay. Get out wow. of here. Wow. Gotta stay sharp. That was something special. Kano's back, y'all. Think I'm scared of this rock guy? Sure are. I'm Kano. I'm a little scared. Yeah. I was gonna say, aren't you guys also supposed to be kind of like we're buds? Not, not when we're fighting to the death right here. Well, you gotta play as arcade ladder to find out. Oh. Ooh. Which will be out next week. Oh no, there's arcade. You can yeah. Do, yeah. It's a traditional tower, I should say, ladder ending. I'm not used to that string, that's for sure. Yeah. I know what I need to do. And he's got a pretty good upper yeah. head there. Yeah, it covers a lot of space way up in the air. It's pretty good. Oh! Boom! Oh, that was <laughs> sweet. May I get a rematch? No. Thank I'll, you. I'll rematch. I said one more. You, you said one. That was it. That was a, That's what you get. He hit rematch. Everyone gets an exception. Round one. Fight. This is malarkey. No, that's a meter loss. <laughs> oh. Tried to use it? <laughs> Load it out, son. I do like the crystal cutter. The rolling rock there. Uh, it's got you right where it was. Uh oh. Oh, I messed up. No! Oh. oh no! Oh. oh, why did you do that? Oh, I no, did you I do do that? Oh, oh, Tyler. You guys like it to the other match. That's what we would call a scramble. Look at the other one. Thank you. 
We four do. of them. And we also have classic skins. Ooh. They come with the combat pack and you can get them next week if you don't. John, can we show that quick picture of the skins? There we are. Look at those Quan luxurious Chi. skins. I'm a big yes. fan of MK3 Kung Lao. Yeah. yeah. I, I think that's one of his coolest looks. And it, But it also has classic purple pants jacks, right? Yeah. Mm. Awesome. Yeah. And MK4 Quan Chi. Yeah. Awesome. Which a lot of people were asking for, too. Yeah. So there you go. You're welcome. So let's. you want to maybe show off what do you want to do here? Um, well, I would like to do, try and do a classic fatality match between me and Steve. Okay. Melina Katana. Okay. I think that sounds good. Katana, Melina. Wait, we should probably use some classic costumes. Uh, Tyler doesn't have it unlocked on his Xbox for Melina. Well, you gotta play mobile to get it. I do, I do have, I have done that for mobile. Either. Okay. Hmm. All right. You know, the sisters did wear very well at Evo, too. Mm-hmm. Yes. Sun used Katana and Salt Face, Salt Face nearly placed with Melina. I know. I was pulling for him. I really was. Salt Face. Get him next time. You are unfit to live. Shao Kahn disagreed. His realm thinks as I do. Round one. Fight. Here we go. Royal Storm versus Piercing. No first hit yet. Can you turn the volume off on the phone at some point? Yeah, yeah, I apologize. And now we're in the blender. It's going to be a little while before we play again. 33%. How do you think about the Molina matchup, Steve? Uh, I think it's a, a close matchup. Yeah. They're, they both have good projectiles. They both do good damage. Derek, what do you think about it? Do you enjoy it? I don't want to talk. Derek, you have to. Do I really? People on people at Evo were actually kind of, they are like, it's kind of unfair that Derek never talks when you always talk during the matches. It's because you always talk. Yeah, I do, because you, you think you have to focus. How much do you have to focus on wake up, wake up ball? That's true. Oh, wow! Well, sometimes, <laughs> sometimes he doesn't do a wake up ball, he stands up and then does a ball. Right. So I mix it up some. Yeah. Oh, no. City, Steve. Population here. Oh, what? 
a real master comeback. Oh, it didn't do the achievement because we know Tyler hasn't got one of those. Maybe I already had it. Wait, no, if it, if it didn't do it, it means I've already had it. Mm. Huh. Oh! Just got told. Now, Steve, the whole reason for this match is for whoever wins to yes. do the classic fatality. Yes. So please don't mess with Oh, no. Whoever wins. Why are you assuming I'm going to win? Yeah. I mean, I just had an amazing comeback. You did. You're, you're amazing. Oh, dang it. Alright, All right. I mean, it's valid. Oh! <laughs> I guess we have to do it again. Are you kidding me? That was that was a I DJT Evo moment right there. How many Evo medals do you have, Steve? Three. And you just dropped a fatality that I told you you had to do if you won, but 30 seconds ago. Will you put pressure on me? To do a fatality. You've been on the biggest stage of them all, the grand A of them all, yeah. Evo. And you couldn't pull off a fatality? I'm only human. Also, I'm, I'm retired. I'm washed up now. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Well, I think you still got the skills. Thanks, Tyler. You've taught me a lot of this game. You've been a better player. Ooh, that's punishable. Yeah. You thought you had a range there. Just right in front of me. Oh, that was better. Wow, damn fair roll. All right, you're playing well today. Oh. Am I gonna throw this away, Tyler? Oh, I don't know. I mean, Darren's playing well. You gotta give him that. Oh. downloaded. Tyler, help me out here. I always help you. Don't freak out. I'm freaking out. <laughs> you got this. Do, do, oh. do those weird cancels you do. He won't just do it, those. Weird cancels? The, the, the float. I, oh, you're done. No, I can break this. I'm left. Choice. Yeah. We have to do one more. One one. If someone doesn't do a classic fatality here, there's problems. We'll get it. The reason we did this. There's too much pressure. There's really just too much pressure. I've never felt pressure like this before. Never. You know what? I apologize. Guys, just have fun. Was that optimal damage there, Steve? Nah, that wasn't exactly optimal. But it's good enough. What would Katana Prime say? Um, he would understand. Okay. It's all about efficiency. Oh. <laughs> You're pretty dire. <laughs> We're really not going this round. No offense, I've had this happen against Steve before. Oh, but I, it's not flawless, so that feels good. Oh. I like to play too, Steve. You'll get your turn. Oh, will I? Oh, my. Oh, my. I was thinking about breaking this combo, but, you know, I figured I might as well hold on to some music. Oh, hey, Anderson. Oh! Derek just got flawless. So when this match is over and after the fatality, we need oh, yeah. salt cam probably on him. Oh, man. Flawless victory. Fatality. And the classic win pose, MK2. Flawless victory. Uh, oh. Derek, so hey, listen, I want to tell you this first off. It was 2 1. Yeah. He, he took a match. He took me to one and then hit you once. You didn't hit him once there. No, well, I mean, yeah, I mean, it was almost a double flawless. Yeah, that was pretty good. Almost. But though. he went into like evil Steve mode. Right? Like I've seen it before. I've seen it before. That was that sucked. That sucked. Uh well, you know, that is Trimmer, guys. Trimmer is available today if you have Xbox uh one and PS4, so he's ready to go. Next week, Tuesday, you'll be able to buy them a la carte, plus the new costume. <coughs> you also get the fatality packs for free. So I think it's time for a very special moment. Wait! What's we that? have the birthday shout-outs. Gotcha. 
Birthday shoutouts. We got Spike, happy birthday, and Tiago and Sidon in studio, happy birthday. Mm -hmm. And the first time we have a wedding congratulations for Farzan. Congrats on your weddings. Congratulations. Cheers to you. Sir. Do you think they're going to have an MK themed wedding? Um, no, they got married and they just wanted a wedding shout out. It was not like a Liu Kang Katana. That's what I was hoping for. Situation. Wow. Can I have my belt, please? Where is it? Where is it? See, it has it. All right. There you are. <sighs> Don't touch it. Now, Tyler, remember last week. You had it won and you gave him an extra game. Yeah. That was a huge mistake. Are we doing mains? Is that the... Is that I'm, I'm playing cage. You play what you want to play. Um, I did... Yeah, I beat him last week and I let him... I let him go and I was like... I, I gotta hold that because I... He won that. I didn't win that. I didn't win anything because right. I, I gave it up. Um, a lot of people at Evo told me I was dumb for that, but I wasn't... Yeah. The truth is, like, I just wanted to play more matches because I was having fun. Right. So I don't really... I mean, I'm sad I didn't get the belt. I'd like to get the belt back to spin a little bit, you know? But... but play to win, man. Yeah, yeah. I get it. I was, I wasn't super salty because I was like, it's my fault. I wanted to play more. Sometimes I, you were salty. You yeah. were like salty. a little bit emo. There's two names I have here. It's first hit Tyler because I get first hit a lot, mm -hmm. and also one more lands down. Yeah. Because every time true. we have our final match, I always have to play one more. Yeah. So that time it kind of bit me in the ass. Tyler and I will do two out of three, and it'll turn into like. So this is officially seven. a two out of three. Two out of three. Two out of three. Okay. Here we go. It's me. Round one. Fine. Melina with the condom skin. Oh. Ooh, how did he know? Interesting. Not a wake up roll, a start off oh. the roll. Mixing it up a little bit. Oh no. Alright, we got the X not punch. Interesting. Standing one into four two, because Derek read one one three. Good mix up. Oh no. Goes for the throw. Good mix ups after the nut punch, Tyler. You're mixing it up well. Thank you. Good anti fireable teleport. Here's the size. Not a maximized punish, but it'll do. Oh. No. Uh oh. Alright, Derek. Oh! Nope. Okay. Had to break it there. I feel like that was a good break on my part, right? Yeah, make sure you win. It's, use it's worth using the resources to clutch out the win. All right. Medium reward. Yeah. It goes under the shadow kick. Alright, shadows are out. Oh, okay. No convert. No punish. The shadows have not been used so far. I won the round with the last one. Alright, here we go. No! Watch out for the wake up roll. Interesting. Mixing up wake up size. I blocked too. I ran a block. I felt good about that. See, we make fun of Derek for his predictableness, but he mixes it up. Not predictable, he hasn't heard his phone up yet. No, I'm sorry. Jump in combo. Okay, good block. Yeah, you're doing the nut punch a lot. Sometimes when I get freaked out, I just go to it too much. Yeah, you get freaked out a lot too. I know. Oh. But you can make a comeback here. One nut punch. All right, here we go. He's in the grinder. Oh no, no! Drop him. It's okay. That was a reset. He has no bar. She has no breaker. So one nut punch could be a difference maker here. Jump in. Oh, good block from Derek. No punish though. Wake up roll. I thought he was going to go for this. No, no, no. Yeah, you can't do that. Finish him. Thank you. You have to do down a hundred times. Yeah, yeah, that's the actual input. Mm -hmm. Oh, Nina, win. Fatality. Okay. Classic win pose. Classic win pose. It sucks, but I've been beating Molina a lot at my desk lately. Well, I've never been to a tournament where you could say, excuse me, referee, no, I'm, no, I'm not casual. I'm not, I'm just saying, like, it makes me sad that I can't seem to find it here. I never can. Hmm. It's weird. Oh. All right. Got to be careful. He's going to teleport. I know. 
Don't tell that, because don't forget that I know and it won't be what you're saying. He's gonna do it anyway. Okay, that's 100%. Yeah. Oh no! Stop blocking too soon! Oh. oh. I'm not sure I'm punishing that well. You should duck the side and then punish. Because she'll float to, after the side is done, she'll kind of float down on the ground. Uh. Alright, we got the corner pressure. Nope. Oh. Nuts, nuts. Nutty X-ray does not pay off. Oh, no! that's, that's going to be really bad in the next round. <laughs> Good blocking. I knew it was, I knew it was coming back. I kind of felt it. Okay, a lot of zoning in this match. Now remember, Johnny Cage's projectile does a lot of damage. Oh, no. Yeah. Okay. All right, here's an opportunity. To punish. Oh, almost. No! I like it. Get out of the corner. That's worth losing a little bit of damage. There's a huge risk. Oh man, it might not pay off. It's too oh, oh no, you waited a little bit too long. Oh, that's brutal. Derek, I think you're looking good today. Thank you. Thank you. Final round. It's okay though, Tyler. Yeah, it's fine. Okay, shadows. <laughs> now you have a life lead. Teleport though, you're gonna lose that life lead. A lot of, a lot of run up punches. Overhead. Oh. Alright. Can't really use it. Good whip punish on the roll. Hashtag you suck. Can't be dropping the combos. I know. Okay, my trait is in play. Will Derek take a risk with the extra or play it safe? No! Oh, that's a big punish. No. Okay, okay. Oh. One to one. This is pretty intense. Here's, Johnny. <laughs> Here's Tyler's Johnny. Johnny Cage wins. Sweet. Okay, hey. Well, final one, man. <sighs> Check my notes. Check my notes on my phone. Yeah. Like, uh... Yeah, one guy from the thing. What does it just say, Derek? Wake up, roll. <laughs> Did you switch the period? If he has yes. three bars, he will x-ray. Yes. yes. These are all, all valid DK tips. If you do anything punishable, all he'll do is throw. <sighs> That's <Yeah>. nuts. <laughs> <laughs> John, who are you going for here, John? Do you have a favorite right now? Don't you mess this up. No. Oh, so we have a, we have a skin switch, Commando. Can I just play switch games after? Yeah, that's le that's tournament legal. That's okay. Round <laughs> one. It gives you a, a fresh outlook. All right. Very patient zoning. Very interesting. Tyler activating stun double, knowing he was getting zoned out, taking damage just to get the doubles out. That could be a good choice. So far, you've not made hay with me, though. Okay. Derek's done a really good job zoning this round. Yeah. All right, no more shadows. No more meter. Okay, very dominant round. Round two, fight. Back to the zoning. Oh no, goes in with the teleport. Ah! Block. And then we got the punch. No. Oh no. no. You can't just keep a drop off stream every time. Every time. God, it sucks. You emo. I'm a little emo about that actually. Alright, don't give up. Don't give up. Oh man. The low side going right on that big shadow kick. God. Oh no! That might be 
a championship drop combo. Derek is in the driver's seat. He's looking strong here. He's looking crisp. He's not dropping anything. He has no bar for wake up. She has no wake up opportunity here. Oh no, it's, it might be over. One more side. Oh no. Tyler. Still champion. Yeah. You gave me three out of five last time. So right. I think it's only fair that I do the same for you. That's classy. Do you want to do this? Well, duh. <laughs> yeah, duh. All right. I like the respect here. I feel like I'm close to... to, to you know what it might be? What? You're talking too much. Point. Let Steve just commentate. Let him do his thing. All right, so like last week, or two weeks ago, we saw this three out of five was a big mistake. We'll see if a lot of people prefer three out of five. They say it helps the better player win. So we're gonna see who's truly better here. Who's good at adjusting? Who's good at adapting? Who's better in long sets? Not me. All right. Jumps into the sides. Derek zoning has completely shut down. Tyler. I don't have to get through it. Really yeah. don't. Fight. He's done a really good job mixing up teleport, low side, ex side. Here you go. You can't zone now. He has he has no options right now. Oh my god. I block my roll combos you can roll every time. Yeah. Well he's gonna roll anytime, every time anyway. Alright. Alright, good blocking. Alright, see? If you just complete your combos, you'd be doing really good. Good block. Interesting, getting out the corner again. Derek's doing a very good job today using interactables to get out of the corner and escape Johnny King's pressure. Yes. She's back into the corner. What a level of Yomi there. Derek did not wake up attack, but you jumped up reading it, and he got out of, he got out of the pressure safely. Derek, Derek went to a Yomi level two there. <laughs> the armor on Lena's cartwheel is only active at the beginning, so it ran out there. Derek switching to offense. Oh, now Derek's getting zoned out. Things are falling. Chaos. Or Katana. Yeah. Alright, it's it's even here. Derek does have a slight meter lead though. He can afford to break, but Johnny Cage doesn't necessarily give you a lot of opportunities to break because of his free throw and his down. Oh, oh. You just... and now the bar's wasted! Derek with a, a huge lead now! Don't throw it away! Oh! Oh, okay. Okay. Wow, it's and two two. Two two. And because of that brutality, you have the momentum. He, sh he shook up. I'm just dropping every combo. All right. All right. I think you have an edge here, a mental edge here. Liu Kang. Oh, wow. We have a character switch. Character switch, folks. Never seen this before. This is intense. Mm -hmm. But I am best in the Quatan jungle. <laughs> you have that's, a stage that is true. Yeah. The vine. The vine. Yeah. yeah. Right. The vine, vine of truth. Well, technically, if he's doing low fireball, you could hang on the vine yeah, to let's, avoid it. Let's that for could some be, divine yeah. intervention. Right. Oh. Remember earlier when you said you didn't like puns? Yeah, I well, really said that. All right, so Liu Kang, a very interesting character switch. Very rare here for the championship belt. EX Fireball does a lot of damage. Light kick. Oh, wow. EX Nut Punch. And it was sweet. Derek maintaining his zoning playstyle, even with Liu Kang. Uh oh. Alright, it's dead even here. Good block from Derek. Punishes it with the overhead. Not a lot of damage, but it's a knockdown. Again, good blocking. Now Tyler's in the corner. Oh man, good read. Fine. Okay, uh oh. You could have a huge comeback here. Convert! Great conversion! No! What a perfect time to finally hit a combo. <laughs> <laughs> Love and hate you right now. You are now on set point here, championship point. How am I doing? Good blocking. Okay. Derek's going all in. Yeah, it's not punch. Momentum has shifted in your favor. Maybe. Maybe. Maybe not. You gotta get out of the corner, though. 
All right, down four. Oh, wow. Very good use of armor. That's good. Keep Eagle in the corner. You got to give props. That was good. All right, so that was good. All right, now you're out of the corner. Uh-oh. Fireballs. Oh, no, he blocked. Nice block. Good blocking. All right. He won't be able to break, so... Gosh, here we go. Throw. Derek's light lead is very slight. Fine! Amazing! Amazing use of the vine. Oh no! Oh! It could be this could be it! Championship point! No! 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 Maybe three out of five does show who ah, the superior player is. Oh my lord. Um wow, wow. Wow, dude. Oh. Johnny K. Okay, wow. <laughs> um, five out of seven. No, but I will say this: I think from this day forward, we should always get three out of five for the German. Been about whatever. No, thanks. Um, well, uh, I dropped a ton. Probably the most comments I've ever dropped today. But I feel like I was doing some good reads and, and re recovering after the drop combos. Yes. I think I probably shouldn't have changed my character. Yeah, that was probably a mistake, and giving him the extra game. But lessons learned. I thought I was going to be so disappointed. Well, guys, um, the back the belt is back with me after a... You know, I made the decision, you made the decision. We're out even three out of five from now on for the belt. Yeah, whatever. Um, Johnny Cage wins. Thank you, John, for helping us out today. Thanks, John. Thanks, John. Say Thanks hi to me. Thanks yeah. for having me. Standerson, at Standerson is his Twitter. If you want to follow John, he's a producer here at NetherRealm. Uh, been here for how long now, John? About a year. Now. About a year. That's yeah. enough about John. Sorry. <laughs> we love John. Thank you so much. Steve, thanks for coming by. Thanks for having me. Uh, congratulations to everyone who went to EVO, regardless of how you play it. Yep. It was awesome to see so many great players there. Sonic Fox, you're the man now. Uh, can't wait to see what happens next. And the great thing is, the tournament season continues. Yep. That's just the beginning. ESL season two coming up, Derek. Yeah. A pleasure as usual, man. I have the belt. Uh, you know, this is that that's, that's combat pack one for everybody. Uh, so there we go. Combat back. We're out. There we are. Um, we're going to come back and do some play against the community soon. Yeah. And there we go. So, everybody.